Today's daily dose of math is about drawing an acute angle. First, we have to know what acute angle means. It means that the angle is less than 90 degrees in its measure. Let's draw one. We start with a baseline, any line that we can draw anywhere on our page, and we put the protractor on the baseline so that the zero dot of the protractor is on one end of the line that we drew. The zero dot is this part of the protractor and the baseline is this line along the bottom. I'm going to draw a 70 degree angle. So to do that, I have to count up the degrees with these numbers on the edge of the protractor. I'm counting up to 70. But notice that there are two sets of numbers. Because I am starting at zero, I'm using the inside set of numbers and I count up those numbers until I get to the 70. That's where I need to draw my other line. I draw the line up through the 70. Now I have drawn a 70 degree angle. I can move the protractor out of the way and I want to label my angle. I'm going to label it with its measurement, which is 70 degrees. And I do that showing an arc. An arc is a curved line that you can draw. This one is a little messy, but that's okay. Let's draw another angle. This time, let's draw a 25 degree angle. I need a baseline to start with, and I'm going to put it here. This time though, I'm not going to draw the angle from the left corner of the line that I started with like I did before, I'm going to draw the angle on the other side. I put my protractor so that the zero dot is on that end of the line and I count up to 25. Notice now I can't use the inner set of numbers. When I'm on this side of the protractor I have to use the outer set of numbers and I count up to 25 there. So I have to draw a line that goes through that 25. There, I've drawn a 25 degree angle. I'll move the protractor out of the way and I'll put the 25 degree label in there and I'll draw an arc. Again, that arc is a little messy, but it's good enough. Now, let's draw a third one. This time, I think I'll draw a 52 degree angle. I'm going to put a baseline on my page, decide which end I want to draw the angle from. I think I'll draw it from this end. I put the zero dot of the protractor on that end of the line and make sure the line is on the baseline of the protractor. I'm counting up to 52 degrees, so I'm over on the right side of the protractor. I'm using the inner set of numbers again. 52 is about here. I draw a line through there. move the protractor out of the way, and I label my angle. 52 degrees with an arc. This is how we draw an acute angle. Any angle that is between zero and 90 degrees. That's today's daily dose of math. Please like, subscribe, and share.